Hey guys, welcome back to Leah's YouTube video. Hi guys. Hi guys. We do my here today. Hey guys, I decided to prep Leah's hair last night in order to make our hair day go by fast. I washed Leah hair, blow dried it, and moisturized it just to make our transition into her hair day very easy. So my first step is to take out Leah braids. Keep in mind this step is optional. You can jump right into creating this hairstyle right after you wash and blow dry your hair. Even though I detangled Leah's hair last night, I still decided to use a little bit of products from Cantu for Kids in, in order to ensure that her hair is um, easy to maneuver throughout this hairstyle. Next, I'm going to start by using Comet Biologic products. Excuse me if I'm saying the name wrong. This is my first time using this hairline. So I'm going to start off by going in with the Olive and Honey Hydrating Balm with grapeseed oil and pure wildflower honey. It softens and hydrates the dry hair. You can use it on dry hair or you can use it on damp hair. Either way, it's fine. The next step is to double strand twist the front of her hair. When I prepped Leah's hair for this hairstyle, I made sure to leave out a small portion in the front of her hair, which wouldn't interfere with the rest of the hairstyle. As I double strand Leah's hair, I'm using Comet Biologics Amala and Olive Heavy Cream with castor oil and botanicals. It is used so I can soften and moisturize her hair. It states that it softens and moisturizes very dry, coarse hair so I'm using this product in order to ensure that her hair stays moisturized as I move to the next step. Hey guys, I'm almost finished. I got one more hair right here. In this next step, I decided to flexi rod Leah's hair. Um, you can buy these rods from any beauty supply store if you like. Um, I didn't catch the footage of me actually flexi rotting her whole hair, okay. but um, we let it sit for about three hours and now we're gonna take it out. Yeah, you can take it out. Now my second to last step is me taking out Leah's braids in order for me to put her hair in a ponytail. Some people decide that they um, prefer to use two buns or one bun. Um, being that Leah's hair is coarse, it would have made more sense for me to put it in two ponytails or two buns. But I just wanted to do a quick ponytail because we had somewhere to go. So um, after I loosed out her braids, I moisturized it and um, brushed it up in one and you're gonna see the finishing touches at the end. As I brush through Leah's hair, I find it more easier that I take it piece by piece, being that her hair is naturally coarse. So as I brush it in um, sections, I decided to um, put it in a ponytail. Off camera, you can't actually see what I've done because most of the footage I um, lost. However, I um, use edge control in order to put on her edges and smooth her hair in. And now the next step is for me to take out the flexi rods. Um, some people prefer after they take the flexi rods out to separate the double strand twist, but 
for me, I liked how it came out. So I decided just to, you know, take out the flexi rods and just to tease it a little bit. And um, my next step now is to add a bow to her hair for, as the finished touch. Thank you for tuning in to Leah's Hair Tutorial. We appreciate your views, comments, and subscriptions. We love you guys. Bye.